No, I'm not a writer. Okay. So I was driving around last night looking for some new park ups and I thought this morning well there's nothing really else you can do in lockdown and it's wet so why not make a video on park ups. Finding the right park ups pretty important because you got to consider a few things. Is it safe? Can I legally park here? And am I going to get a knock on the door from the police? Now that hasn't happened to me yet. What I thought I'd do in this video is I'd share different types of park ups that I'd normally go for and then share the pros and cons to each one. So first on the list will be a pay and display car park like the one I stayed in last night. So the pros are with pay and display car parks and normally they're free after a certain time. Like this car park's actually free after 6pm so that's always a bonus. Now the cons would be sometimes at night you are the only vehicle left in the car park so you do stick out a bit like a sore thumb and I just personally feel you could be making yourself a potential target for unwanted attention. Remember, always put your belt on before second gear. Sometimes I'll choose to stay in a forest park up. Now the pros here, it's pretty nice to wake up in nature and you know, it just feels good to be around it. It can be nice and quiet, but the cons outweigh the pros for me. Uh, these sort of places always seem to be a bit of a magnet for people to come smoke the reefer and they can play their music pretty loud at night. Um, so I guess that cancels out the nice and quiet. But most of all, it is scary. If you've ever watched any horror movie, every bad scenario will play in your head. So any noise you hear, you can be a bit jumpy. Um, so the quality of sleep's not always that great. So for me personally, it's all about stealth. Um, so I prefer to park down residential areas, especially if the road has other work vans. I just think it's better to blend in, like this leaf. On its own, it stands out, but put it with others and it's harder to notice. But above all else though, it's really about your own safety. If you found a new park up and you're just not feeling it, just move on, you know? There's loads of spaces, loads of places you can go. Try and get a feel for it first, what I normally do is I just sit in the front of the van for about 10 minutes and then just try and take mental notes of how busy it is, how many people go by, what's the area like. Um, and yeah, you know, find them park ups, add them to the list. And I'll see you in the next video. That's my theme song.